Edmonton town leaders are recognizing the first responders who fought a fire that destroyed the well-known DR Music Center. That fire in early July also displaced eight people from their homes. Town News reporter Cindy Jacksheimer spoke with some of the heroes at today's ceremony. One month ago today, a fire ripped through this building in downtown Vinton. But what's being remembered isn't the tragedy, but the heroism shown by first responders. Uh, most of those guys would say, well, you know, it's our job, but uh, they did a really professional job and did it in a very efficient manner. Thankfully, there was no loss of human life, and I think that's because they did such a great job. Captain John Farron with Roanoke County Fire and Rescue responded to the call of the DR Music Building engulfed in flames. This was such a large event, a large fire. We normally don't have, you know, a fire this big. The building was demolished to completely extinguish the fire. The building housed businesses and apartments. And our community immediately stepped up to uh, help the uh, victims of the fire. So uh, even though it was a sad day, there were a lot of uh, positive aspects revealed that day. One of the positives, the county's dependable first responders who were given a ceremony for their commitment to keeping the community safe. It's good to be recognized, you know, for the calls that we do run. I mean, we appreciate it, but like I said most of the guys here are, just, are humble. And, uh, you know, it, most of them will say we're just doing our job, and, uh, but it's good to have some recognition. Property owners and community leaders are still debating on what to do with the space now. In Vinton, Sydney Jacksheimer, 10 News, working for you.